All right, guys, it just comes a little bit quieter now. When I've just done the videos there, you'll see in a sec, it was very busy around, so uh, yeah, I didn't really, don't think it made much sense of what I said. But I want to really show you what, what the um, installation is and why it's important. So when you've got a full electric car at the moment, you've got to have a driveway, off-street parking, to have your charger, to charge your car. Now, a lot of people who want full electric can't because they're in like a terraced house or they're in the street with no driveway. Uh, or if obviously if you're a business, and you want to provide charging at your business outside onto the public road. You don't want to because rapid charges are very expensive. Do you know what I mean? They're sometimes 20 grand, 15, 20 grand plus for a rapid charge, yeah, like a commercial one. And obviously you don't want them out in the public's eye. So this installation is purely a way to get the um, charging cable from one location to the street without obviously being a trip hazard or anything like that. And uh, at the moment, it's early stages, yeah, where the councils, some councils are looking into at the moment and possibly might be interested. So if you are interested in an installation like this, make sure you speak to Car and Cab Care or Costello's EV. And they have all the connections with the councils to see if they can get it installed for yourselves. But I think going forward, this is probably the best option uh, for roadside charging, especially when you haven't got a driveway. I've seen some where they're dangling from like the, the upstairs and they're like people got a duck to walk down the street and stuff i don't think they're good options but i think this one is going to be one of the best because it is buried and it's out the way and it won't cause flooding and it's easy as easy accessible and stuff like that um, and also they said that if you get a charger with two cables you can run two cables down it and then feed two cars so that'd be obviously there's loads of different um, uh, methods and um, stuff on how it works and why it works like so yeah enjoy a couple of little clips of it now i'll show you the inside and the outside of it and the basic fundamentals of the installation and uh, that's it guys hope you enjoyed the little video and hopefully this will be coming um quite popular for the people who want full electric cars and haven't got a driveway do you know what i mean but thanks guys make sure you like subscribe and all that jazz and i'll see you soon all right guys so a few people have asked me um on how this works so the best way for this um usage is obviously if you're you've got no off street parking like no driveway and you're in like a terraced house in a the street then this would be the perfect option for you and also for businesses just so there's um you can keep your very expensive charges out of public hands and then you can run the cable to street parking like it has here at a car and cab and i'm going to show you inside and how it works now but literally it can go from your house, it can go from obviously commercial building, ran under the um, under the uh, side, the, pay, the pavement, through the kerb, and into the charger. I'll show you. Okay. So it's on a piston. So those holes are uh, drains into the soakway, so when it starts raining, the water will um, flush away so it won't stay inside. And also in there, same again, the water will go in there, go through this hot tube and straight into the street. So the water, the, the cable is never sitting in water, it's always uh, drained. And then this little bracket here and the bracket there is to stop people lifting it up, especially mainly kids. If you wanted to rip it up, you could, but it's mainly just stopping like passing by, trying to get into it. And obviously that's in the piston and then to close it over. And then just, that's it, easy as that.